What would be your tip for delivering value early? Don't make it a sales call, make it a consultative uh, sales process. So um, let's, look at, let's look at Drew as an example, right? Drew does consulting, Drew does YouTube consulting. Drew charges thousands of dollars to work with him every month, right? And, and the price is only gonna keep going up. Uh, instead of what most people do when doing consulting is instead of doing some giant pitch deck and some super expensive package, just start with giving them value. Like what Drew should do is do a channel audit. Say, hey, I'll spend 30 minutes of my time for free with you just to look at your channel and give you some feedback and advice and blow their faces off with the value that you give them. So they're gonna come back and say, hey, I'd love to hire you, right? Earlier today, we're talking about um, Ben Hardy and I did a one-on-one -on -one with Ben in front of a live audience of Genius Network and these were all people running a million dollar plus companies and I broke down his channel live and now you know he, he wants my feedback on how to keep growing um, and I, I could take him on as a client if I wanted to if I wanted to screw Drew over you know <laughs> stick a knife in his back <laughs> <laughs> and say you know what <laughs> forget Drew I'll do the work for you you know he'd probably say yes why? Because I did the free session. Now I'm not going to do that. And I don't want to be in the consulting business, but um, it's because I did the free session. So I never had a call. I never made any proposal. I, I, as soon as somebody wants a proposal, it's like, forget about it. Um, Jeremy and Bo, who I'm uh, investing into, who both run service businesses, we never do a proposal. Never. It's like, if you, if you need a proposal, you, you just haven't done, like we, did, we sucked at actually giving value to them. So no proposals, just give value, wow them with the value, and then, uh, and then sell. Like the sale comes to you. Excellent. It's the same thing for Zane. Like Zane should be doing live confidence coaching. That's why I went on him. If you tuned in at all on Tuesday, where he's talking about how he needs to have <laughs> this perfect website, and it's like, oh my God, Zane, you are just missing it. It's, you don't need any of that stuff, right? All he needs is to do coaching, make the videos, show what you can do live, and then people will say, how do I hire you? 